So you bought a quest or getting one, and one promise you made was you will use it to work out and get those rock hard abs you've always dreamed of. But you're not sure which of the best games or apps to help you do that? Well, have no fear, Whackman is here. Today, I'm going to make sure you have nothing holding you back from keeping that promise, and we will go through the best VR workout games on the quest. Some of these games will have special Quest 3 features, but all of the games will also work on the Quest 2 if you bought that instead. Not only that, I will be giving away one of these paid games, so keep watching. Talking about special features, the sponsor of today's video is VR Wave. This is actually the perfect sponsor for this video, because these will make sure the lenses in your headset are protected, and the amount of movement you do in VR workout games and the amount you will sweat, you will be grateful you put these lenses on. The VR Wave lenses don't only protect your lenses, you can even have them set to your specific prescription, meaning that you won't need to wear your glasses when you're using the Quest, as you'll be able to see perfectly. Glasses can actually scratch your VR lenses pretty bad, and there won't be any way to fix them. So if you wear glasses, I highly recommend you, at the very least, get the blue light filter and the anti-glare lenses, as that also helps with eye fatigue, and with your VR headset being so close to your eyes, you really feel the difference. The VR Wave lenses are available for both the Quest 2 and the Quest 3. They are also really easy to install and remove as the lenses are magnetic once clipped on. This means you can easily take them off and clean them, much better than trying to clean the actual lenses which you might end up scratching and then you're in for a nightmare. The link to the website is in the description below. Well, let's get straight into the video. Now these games aren't in any particular order, but number 1, Le Mills Body Combat. I am talking about this game first as I think it is literally the best one I've come across. Plus this is the game I will be giving away to one of you guys and the winner will be selected on New Year's Day, just so you can meet your New Year's resolution. To enter, simply like the video, subscribe to the channel, put on bell notifications and comment hashtag WackmanFitness down below. I will reply to the comment of the winner letting them know that they've won. Now unlike a lot of fitness VR games, this one isn't on a monthly subscription. You buy the game and it's yours. Now talking about the workout, it is actually incredible, it has 50 different workout plans from beginner to advanced. I'm exhausted with the beginner workout. There are also 11 different environments to keep things fresh. They have also implemented mixed reality for the Quest 3. This means that you can see the real world and still feel like you're working out with someone there. Talking about someone there, there are coaches that motivate you whilst you work out. And it feels like someone's actually there. Plus, there are really decent music tracks to keep you energized. Honestly, this is the only game you do need to work out. But if that's not enough for you, let's carry on. Number 2. VR Workout now, if the price was holding you off lay mills, then how about a workout game that is absolutely free? Well, VR Workout is exactly that. Now, this game has come really far from where it originally was. They've improved the graphics, all the visuals, and even has hand tracking, which means you don't even need to use controllers to work out, which is honestly the best thing about it. And now they've even added mixed reality to the mix. They are constantly updating the game and adding new features into it. Currently, they've added a new jungle gym feature where you will be able to use your chair and wall as part of the exercise. Now they have added a payment mode, gotta make some money somehow, but this can be bypassed by hosting a multiplayer room to use the features without limitations. Honestly, I think for the amount of value this game gives, it does come close to Lay Mills itself, but the fact that it is free is incredible. Obviously, remember there will be quality differences between the two. You get what you pay for, usually. Now I don't want to overwhelm you with the same type of game, so let's mix things up a little bit and move on to number 3. The Thrill of the Fight Do you hate the idea of working out? and can't even get up to do it due to the mental block it gives you? Well, Thrill of the Fight isn't a workout game. It is a realistic boxing game. And better yet, you avoid the brain damage in real life, but get all the benefits of knocking the other person out. Honestly, this is one of my favorite VR games, but it is incredibly tiring. I have never been able to go more than two fights, as after the first three rounds, I am gasping for air. Now, usually there was a big risk playing this game as you couldn't see the outside world and you could end up knocking someone else out. Knock him out! Knock him out! Oh. Damn. Damn. <laughs> well, surprisingly for the Quest 3 version, they've added mixed reality. So hopefully your family doesn't need to do the rope-a-dope to dodge your punches. This is the best boxing game in VR. If you were looking at it from a true simulation perspective. The graphics are crap, but the workout is real. Although there isn't any multiplayer, which is the biggest disappointment in the game. So, that moves on to number 4, Creed, Rise to Glory. Now, if the dullness of the thrill of the fight put you off and you wanted a flashy boxing game to work out, then Creed, Rise to Glory is the perfect game for that. This game is set in the Rocky universe, as is based off the Creed movies. It has all the classic boxers from Rocky, Club Lang, Apollo Creed and the legend Ivan Drago. Plus, this game can be played in multiplayer PvP. And it even has cross-platform, which makes this great game a crap ton of fun. My main negative for the game was that it had artificial stamina, unlike Thrill of the Fire which only used your own. 
However, the developers took that feedback and created a mode which removes the artificial stamina. And now in that mode, you can keep punching until your arms give out. There is also a story mode where the opponents get harder the further you get. Although PvP, I would say, is probably the main selling point for this game and it gives you a real workout plus the amount of characters it has. Number 5. Knockout League Now, if you're thinking Creed sounds good, but I keep punching my kids in the face. Well, Knockout League is actually one of the most fun VR boxing games. I wasn't that big of a fan of this game initially as it just seemed a little bit too childish for me. But I was wrong. The graphics are cartoony and you do get to fight an octopus and a pirate, but the gameplay is great. I only realised this after checking out the mixed reality mode which got me hooked. No pun intended. Here you can set up your room. So either the training exercises such as speed pack or the punching pack training will be in your room. Or you can even fight the boxes. There are some issues where the AI can be a little daft doing the same things over and over which can be easy to predict sometimes. However, the full game is actually quite a lot of fun. And a great workout. So if you're into wacky workouts, Knockout League is fantastic. Number 6. Tower Workout Alright, let's move on to a more traditional workout game but this time let's mix it up. Tower Workout is a free fitness game where you don't even have to download the game as you can play it through the meta browser by just typing the URL. I've also added it into the description. Plus the game is actually quite impressive for a free VR browser fitness game. You can even play using pass through on the Quest 3. However, there are also different environments you can use if you don't want pass through or are on the Quest 2. The game is very fast paced as well and gives you a great workout. But if it is a little too much for you then you can go on easy mode which makes things a lot easier but this will help you get used to things. The only thing holding the game back are the visuals, which aren't that great but for a free VR game, it's pretty cool. Number 7. Power Beats VR This is another fitness game, however this is more of a fast paced game with beautiful environments. You essentially punch and squat most of the time, as well as moving left to right or using the battle ropes with virtual ropes. Although the punching and squatting is actually pretty tough. As for the punching, you can't just do light jabs, it needs to be full force for you to get your points. But the unique thing about this game is that you can even use your own music and the game will create the levels based on the music you give. That's an amazing feature. There is also full control of your workout. You can adjust the speed, strength and precision of the obstacles, meaning you can choose. Do you want an extreme workout or maybe a light one? They've also added mixed reality for the Quest 3 as well, which just makes things easier, but you lose some of the beautiful environment to the environment of your living room. That's up to you which you like better. Overall, it is a great game. Number 8. Les Mills XR Dance Are you bored of the same type of exercises and want some spice in your life and you want to move it, move it? Well, Les Mills XR Dance is a great game that has just come out and it will make you sweat. Plus, it may even teach you how to dance. You actually have a few real life dance trainers. One even looks like Justin Bieber. But basically, you follow the moves of the trainer. You can see your shadow behind them so you can see if you're doing it right. Although I'm not keen on some of the trainers, they don't actually look like dancers and the moves they teach are ones you might find in a step up movie. I did feel a little silly doing some of the dance moves. That being said however, I was sweating a lot. Plus the time goes so fast, you don't even notice it. The songs are quite upbeat as well. Plus there are a lot of different routines you can choose from and it tells you how many calories you lost at the end. Overall, I think this is an enjoyable way to lose weight and the movement isn't extreme so it would be a slow burn rather than an extreme workout. Number 9. O Shape Now if you weren't keen on the hip hop dance moves or songs Les Mills XR Dance has, O Shape is one where you can even add your own songs in and even a level editor so you can dance to I'm a Barbie girl if you wanted. If you're not interested in that then there are still 40 levels that you can dance to. This game is surprisingly tough, you basically need to make the same movements as the shapes coming towards you and it can get very fast depending on the song. There are 4 difficulty levels in case you're struggling or find it too easy. Personally, I think the custom songs are the best part of this game. You can dance to your favourite songs. There are a few videos on TikTok of people doing exactly that. I think it's a great one where you can work out and not even realise you're working out. Now I'm going to give you a few different type of games, but won't go too much into detail as they'll be obvious. So let's start off with some sport games. Number 10. Cybrix. This is essentially playing squash or racquetball in the US. The harder you hit the ball, the more blocks you will destroy. Plus it even has some power-ups. So hitting the ball harder can get you a power ball, allowing you to destroy more bricks or even get another ball. And managing two balls is extremely hard. It's a surprisingly addictive game and will give your arms a great workout. Or maybe just one arm, depending how you play. Number 11. Clean Sheet Have you ever wanted to have people kicking balls at you at 70 miles per hour? Well, if you have, then this is the perfect game for you. Clean Sheets is essentially you becoming a goalkeeper in a football game, or as US folks call it, soccer. This game is actually pretty cool. 
It sounds like a boring concept, but it is a lot of fun. But if you're looking for fitness, you can play the quickfire mode, where the balls are just flying at you and you need to save them all. This game is even multiplayer, so one person can shoot using a device and the other saves it. Main drawback for the game is that you do need a large play space. You don't want to accidentally jump into a wall, because even if you can't see it, it doesn't mean it's not there. Number 12. IB Cricket Now I've included this game because every time I play it, I'm dripping with sweat. Plus my legs feel like jelly, and my back is always sore. It honestly feels like you're really playing cricket. I would say if you're a cricket fan, you will love this game and get a nice workout. I can't stop playing it. It's an extreme amount of fun, and the more you play it, the more of a workout it will be. If you want more details on this specific game, let me know in the comments and I might do a full review. Now last but not least, this isn't a sports game, but oh boy does it work out your legs. Number 13. Crisis Brigade 2 You will become a squatting machine. I think this is an awesome game based on the original Time Crisis games, but now in VR and this sequel has some awesome graphics and great gameplay. But the fact that you have to continuously hide and cover and pop out over and over, your legs will become super strong. The only time you'll stop playing is when you can no longer stand up. Honestly this is one of the most fun games that happen to give you an amazing workout as well. For your legs at least. Well that's all folks, I hope you found something you like. I try to mix things up as I know you need to convince your lazy minds into working out. There will be other games that I've missed but I've avoided the ones that have a monthly subscription as I don't like that model. Let me know which of these games interest you or if there are ones that you think are awesome that I might missed out. Also don't forget to enter this giveaway. Well thanks for watching, have a great day, stay safe and see you next time.